Spartans! This is where we hold them! For our sons! This is where we fight! For our daughters! This is where they die! For Sparta! Good morning, everyone. This is Cav, and welcome to another episode of Spartan Reacts. It's been a while since we've had just a regular old trailer or anything like that, but it's Comic-Con week, so yay! Currently, um, currently there's only one trailer that's piqued my interest enough to warrant doing a video on it, and that's going to be the trailer for The Witcher. It's the official teaser trailer for the Netflix show. Something to be stated right now. A lot of the stuff is going to be going over my head because I'm playing the series. I'm play. I'm literally. I'm playing the Witcher games for the first time ever. Literally right now, I'm in the middle of one. I haven't. I'm. There's going to be so much stuff going over my head. I know characters <laughs> and the basic premise. So that's about it. <laughs> so bear with me if there's like big Easter eggs that I miss. Just. I apologize, let me know, but don't spoil the games for me. I haven't read the books either. It's just something that has been on my list to play slash read for a long time, and I figured, hey, the show's coming out, this would be a good time to actually get to it and do that before the show comes out. Because my thing is, I want to finish the books, and I want to finish the games before the show comes out. That's, that's the big thing. I want to make sure I get that done. But... Again, since I don't know a whole bunch about it, I'm not going to bother talking about it. So let's just go ahead and let's watch it now. Oh, microphone down. I hope audio was still coming through. Well, I didn't even think about that. Microphone was way up here. But anyway, uh, let's go ahead and watch it now. Uh, three, two, one, go! Remember hearing stories about witches? Is it true what they say? Netflix original series. Elves are the original source of the continent. When humans and monsters arrived, elves taught the humans how to turn chaos into magic. And then. That was a murder stroke! The humans slaughtered them. Like I just did a murder stroke with a sword! Chaos I've never actually seen that in a movie thing or a show. World. But without control, chaos will kill you. Oh, that thing. So that's all life is to you? Monsters and money? It's all it needs to be. Something out there waits for you. This child. Oh, I bet that's Siri. Yennefer. Is that Yennefer? Imagine the most powerful woman in the world. Do you have what it takes? Oh, God. Yeah. That armor. She's why they came. Looks you can't weird. Destiny just because you're terrified of it. It's coming. Find guilt for you. I'd say Henry Cavill looks pretty good as Geralt. I can't do this without you. No matter what you choose, you'll come out bloody. Whoa. That was a pretty good shot right there. Uh, that was pretty. That was a fun little trailer. Uh, couple things. Uh, that first shot of him walking uh, with his sword up under that. That's a pretty cool shot. I like how that looks. I think he looks pretty good as Geralt. My only thing I really have with his personal design, his his necklace. The, the symbol looks different than it does in the game. I don't know if it if that's a reflection of how it actually looks in the book, but that looks a little different to me, and that's a little weird. That that feels like a weird thing to change, because that's such of a that's such an iconic part of his character. That that feels like a really weird thing to change. And I do know there's been a lot of talk about oh he doesn't have a beard yada 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 yada. Yad. In the first game he doesn't have a beard, so. And this is supposedly taking place before the first game. I think before the first game. So, 
that all works. They mentioned elves. I don't know anything about elves, so I'm not going to try to comment on the elves because I know nothing. Uh, okay, I want to make a comment because okay, there's this there's this room full of dudes in armor, and I can't quite tell whether or not he has a hammer or a pole arm or something like that, but it looks like he's holding a sword just based on the way the thing looks. And it looks like this this round knight is doing a murder stroke with the sword, which is really cool. I love that, that that's happening. For those that don't know what a murder stroke is, is it's when, because in actual medieval times with battles, uh, you wouldn't be using a sword against actual armor because it'd be really ineffective. The blade would just glance off the plate, the mail, canvas, and what have you. So what they would do is they would grab the sword by the blade in their hands and then they would strike with the pommel and the hand guard kind of turning it into a, like a, a lightweight club and that was what was referred to as a murder stroke and I've only seen it once done in a movie and that was um, Chronicles of Narnia Prince Caspian and they only did it once so if they're doing a murder stroke here That'd be really cool and a really awesome attention to detail in terms of historical accuracy. So, I'm trying to figure out, so, is Yennefer... Because I thought part of the deal with Yennefer was that she was, like, the super beautiful character who was, like, Geralt's true love or something like that. There's debate between Triss and Yennefer. And yet... Is Yennefer that character that's walking around that has, like, her jaw, like, offset? Is there some backstory I'm not aware of? The shot that also we have right here of, like, the castle and the tower out on the island. Absolutely gorgeous. The design of the actual castle itself looks a little weird. The rope bridge going across is a cool thing. It looks like a, almost like a cross between King's Landing and Pike. It looks a little odd, though, just the actual design of how the castle looks. It doesn't look like a natural thing. I also think this little girl, which we see in the next shot, which is at um, 34 seconds timestamp, if you guys want to check, is, uh, I think that's probably Siri, because I think we're going to have young Siri in this. We also see that chain. I remember seeing the chain... If, if we get the chain as a weapon in the game, I don't have it yet, but I remember seeing that chain used in the Witcher 1 cinematic trailer, which is cool, because that's, that's a, another little detail that I don't remember from the games, that I remember from the trailer that's in here. The armor, you can kind of see it in this shot, it looks... I mean, it looks like... Kind of like the armor from which from the Witcher Three box cover, but it looks not as good as well. If that makes sense, we see a monster hand. Ooh, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. I was really trying to find shots. Okay, there's a shot right here of it looks like Siri standing in a desert, looking at something, which I have no idea what it is. It's like some sort of tree sand hourglass thing in the desert don't know what it is all right so it is Yennefer that had that jaw thing going on all right we're coming up to this big battle scene this is the thing that I saw something and it made me skeptical the armor for these guys wearing silver looks okay I can't quite tell whether or not they're wearing male, but it looks like they're not, which is my only thing. But these guys in the black, their armor looks weird. We see it for like a brief shot, and it already looks weird to me. It just stuck out, because there's like weird three-dimensional parts of it that I can see. That's weird. I don't know. If there are better pictures of that armor out there somewhere, let me know. Because there's always behind-the-scenes stuff. There's probably pictures of, like, everything. So if... I haven't seen any behind-the-scenes photos, if you guys are curious about that. I haven't seen anything. Uh, but if there are, like, behind-the-scenes pictures of that armor, 
let me know, or just let me know what it is from the game if it's not too spoilery. Alright, so we also have a shot of it looks like Geralt is, he's going reverse grip on his sword and fighting uh, some guys. Let me look at that sword. What's the grip length on that sword? Is it a two-handed sword or is it a bastard sword? Can't really tell. There's no good shot during this. Oh, it could have looked way back when he just had the sword on his back. But I wasn't even thinking about it then. Um, let me go back and look. Um, I don't know. I feel like that might be a bastard sword, but the the length of the blade. I'm not sure if that correlates with bastard sword. My medieval knowledge is not the best. I have a working knowledge, but I'm not super good. If you want to know someone really good, check out Shadowversity. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Any other really cool shots I want to talk about? His eyes look good. I was concerned about how they were going to make his eyes look, but his eyes actually look pretty nice. Worst monsters are the ones we create. Things with elves. He's doing a thrust with two fingers right there, and I'm wondering if that's going to be one of the... Um, what are, what are the spells called? I forget what the spells that he does are called. That's like all the witchers do. They have the spells with the, the rock thing. I forget what it's called. But it immediately cuts to a scene of... Is that Yennefer or Ciri? I can't tell. In a cave? Like, doing some magic? And then we have the witcher logo. The show logo. Which I am apprehensive of, to say the least. Because again, they're changing the iconic wolf's head symbol, which isn't something I would have thought you'd need to change. Maybe there's like legal reasons they had to change it. But if, they're, if they have legal enough reasons to be making a Witcher show, I don't foresee reasons that they're going to be needing to change that symbol. But uh, we have a bird and we have a star. Star is going to be Yennefer. She's got the, the star, the necklace, maybe. Bird, I got no freaking clue. I got no freaking clue who had a bird symbol. I don't know. And then we have some cool looking spider monster. Crawling its way out of the swamp. If that's a thing in the games, I haven't fought one yet. And then that great shot of Geralt just standing there. Ooh, that gives us a much better shot of his armor. Studded armor. Not a thing. Leather armor. Not a super big thing. But I'll forgive it. Looks rigid enough that maybe it's like leather coated plate. Maybe. I don't know. But studded armor. Not a thing. Hair looks a little more blonde than white in this shot. That could just be because dirt and wear. The eyes look great. It's such an intense <clears throat> look. It's really cool. I really like it. But uh, that's actually going to be it for this video. If you liked it, please leave a like and a comment down below. I'm getting kind of excited for this show. Apprehensive, just based on a couple things I saw. I'm not done with the game. Uh, I don't even know if it's possible to finish the game the games before the series comes out but i mean what's life without a little without a little risk a little daring but uh yeah that's gonna be it thank you guys for watching and i'm gonna see all of you guys in the next video stay spartan strong <laughs>